Welcome back to my channel. Friends, in last video we tested the optocouplers in this board, and today we are going to test this hex inverter HE4049IC. It is using one, two, three, four, five, six, six ICs, and these are installed on the IC sockets. How we can test if you find CD4049? What is this and how we can test it using multimeter? Today I will not use LEDs or other things. I will use multimeter. If you see its circuit diagram, its data sheet, it has inverters. 1A that is input at pin number 3, pin 2 is output. 5 input, 4 output. 7 input, 6 output. 9 input 10 output 11 input 12 output 14 input 15 output it is 16 pin IC if we check it it have cut mark here pin number 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 to test it I will apply power and if we see its pin out, pin number 8 that is VSS, that is ground pin. Pin number 1 is supply voltage, VDD. We will apply VDD here, that is 12 volt. And the last pin, pin number 8, that is ground pin. I will connect positive voltage here, ground here. We can apply from 3 volt. To 18 volt set multimeter to DC voltage and we will connect we will connect common to the ground black lead we will connect to the ground the first output that is pin number 2 we will connect to pin number 2 here is pin number 3 3 is input I connected multimeter at pin number 2 it is giving 13 volt now I will connect it to positive voltage it, it is now low I will connect to ground it is high so first gate is ok we will connect to pin number 4 1 2 3 4 and we will give this input pin to pin number 5 5 is input I will connect to ground it is now 14 volt I will connect to positive voltage when we will apply high input at that time the output will low because it will give inverted output now I will connect to pin number 6 that is here this is output pin number 6 is output now I will connect to pin number 7 input 7 input input is high when pin number 7 is high 6 is low input low output high because it will provide inverted output now pin number 9 is input pin 10 is output 8 this one is 9 pin 9 input and pin 10 this is pin number 10 We will connect to ground, the output is high. We will connect to positive, the output is low. Input low, output high. Input high, output low. Then pin number 11, input 12 output. 9, 10, 11, 12. 12 output, 11 input. When I will connect input to low the output is high when I will connect input signal to high the output is low then pin number 15 is output 14 input second last pin that is output pin and here we have pin number 14 now I will connect to ground 
the output is high when I will connect to positive the output is low so in R means it will provide inverted output if we take output in this way that means this IC is good sometime any one pin that is stuck high if it, if it is high or low it is not changing the output by applying input that means that inverter is bad sometime the input is low output is low sometime input is high output is high output is stuck at that time we need to replace that IC so this IC is good when we apply high input it will provide low because it have dot function inverted signal I hope so you enjoyed this video if it is good hit the like button if you have any question write in the comments thanks for watching assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh